So I'm here with Lindsay Curran, our integrated pest management coordinator here at Pride's Corner Farms, and, and I hope she's not pointing this gun at me, but tell me uh, what you are doing in our house right here with all this basil behind us. With this blower, I'm applying beneficial insects, which are predatory mites, and their job is to go after the thrips because we don't want uh, things like thrips, aphids, or spider mites on our crops. Um, so these guys are going in and um, suppressing the population of thrips for us. Well, that's a great story, Lindsay, but you know, we, why are we spraying these beautiful basil right now for those pests that you're talking about? Well, of course, the use of pesticides is um, not so safe for us, uh, for the consumers, and for the environment. Um, and also, insect pests like thrips um, can develop resistance to pesticides. Uh, so if we use something like this, like natural enemies, we're going to get uh, better control. Well, here we are in a propagation house for herbs, and, and you're, you're down here shooting those bugs right here, right now. Tell me why. We start applying our biological control agents right at the beginning, um, from the beginning of propagation so that we can control pest populations right at the start and uh, keep our applications of pesticides down. So uh, I see one other feature here, it's the ugly yellow tape. Uh, tell me how this figures into your, your pest control program. This is called bug scan tape. Uh, we put it around various uh, propagation areas to trap adult fungus gnats. So your point being is that uh, with these great herbs that we're, uh, that we're growing here and people, people using these in their, their homes right away, we want to make sure that we're never putting pesticides on those plants. And this is the best way to keep those pests down, correct? Exactly, exactly. This is a predatory beetle. 